Do you like waffles? Yeah, we like waffles. Do you like pancakes? Yeah, we like pancakes. Do you like French toast? Yeah, we like French toast. Dip, 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 dip. Can't wait to get a mouthful. Waffles. 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 Dip, 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 dip. Can't wait to get a mouthful. Do you like waffles? Yeah, we like waffles. Do you like pancakes? Yeah, we like pancakes. Do you like French toast? Yeah, we like French toast. Dip, Everybody, it's Cheese Five Seven Five Three, and um, I'm going to show you another tutorial today. Um, this time, it's going to be how to make custom slides for your iPod, like I do, right here. Now, that's pretty cool, but it's actually really complicated to make. And um, I thought I'd tell you guys real quick um, that how to do that. But um, first, to get um, something out of the way, if um, you guys get me up to 110 views on how to record your computer screen with sound. I'm going to make a special, um, how to jailbreak your iPod or iPhone video, and, um, I'm going to post that up on my page, so you guys can check that out, and, um, then you can watch my, all my other videos, and it might actually make sense if you didn't have a jailbroken iPod before. So, let's get started with custom, um, how to make custom sliders. You can see all these slider folders I have here. So, first, you're going to go to the link in the description, and click, click here to start downloading from Send Space. Now it's going to say slider.zip, and um, that's what you need. So you'll uh, um, end up with a slider folder, a zip um, folder that says slider. Save it to your desktop and um, open it up. So double click on it, and then you'll get up to this page. Don't do anything here, just right click and copy. So now that you have purple sliders copied, paste, and then it's right here. So that's pretty cool. Um, you can rename it whatever you want. So So now we have sliders 2.0. You can open that up and go into bundles com.apple.telephony UI open that up and then you come up to three pictures of purple sliders so first gray with the gray at the end it says G R A Y gray um that is for the slide to unlock so you can edit that um green is the first slide to answer and um red is for slide to turn off so we'll start off with gray and I'm going to skip green because I don't have an iPhone so you know how you ha you if you have a picture of a symbol and you really want it as your slider, I'm going to show you quick how to do that. So it's like two tutorials and more. So yeah, I'm going to see um leave that up there. So go back to here and say I really want um I really want that smiley face to my slider, but it's too big. It's 139 by 139, and I need a slider picture that is exactly 70 by 47, or 71 by 47, whatever you want. So I think it's actually 70, 70 by 47. So I I need a 70 by 47 picture, and this is 139 by 139. Here's what you do. So you just open up this picture. And then you open it up with paint. Well, actually, I'm going to copy this because I like the picture. So. Copy and then paste. Paste. And then there, there's smiley face co um, copy. So go ahead and open, you can open up your symbol and after you copy it. And then open it up with paint. So. <laughs> Seventy by forty-seven now, and you just save that. So you just save it, and then look, it makes the picture all small. So once you have that, you can X out of all that, and go back into your paint session over here. Now erase this entire purple slider. So yeah, so you just erase all of this, 
and then all you do is you paste in the picture that you just, well, basically cropped. So, here it is, uh, smiley face copy, and you open it up, and then look, there it is right there, and I'm just going to save that. So, now I have it up here, and there's the smiley face. So, now we're going to open up red. Now, you can do whatever you want with this. I really don't care, but I'm just going to add another symbol, because I already made one, and I don't feel like putting it Just doing it for nothing, so... I'm just going to erase all this, once again. And I prefer to erase all of it, and then make my own slider, than rather just adjust that one. So, I'm going to paste my other slider that I made, well, my other slider symbol, after I erase this real quick. So, paste and paste from, and then I made a, a small copy of this. So, open, and there it is. So, I'm going to save that, and now I have two symbols. So, once you save those, you can just completely X out of your um, your folder, and um, y you should have WinSCP, which, where is that? So, yeah, there's my WinSCP, you're going to open it up, and you should have WinSCP from my last video, so... I'm just going to enter my Wi-Fi, the username is root, and the password is Alpine, in case you forgot. So, there, connecting to the host, it might take a little while, there, and now you're inside your iPod. Now what you're going to do is you're going to click these two dots, double click that, then you're going to go scroll down, well, no, you just double click on stash, and then you're here. Now, there's all those kinds of things, you can play with those, but um, I'm just going to show you this one. So here's Sliders 2.0, and you're just going to click on that and drag it to where it says Themes. Now, copy. You're going to need Winterboard for this on your iPod, and I showed you how to get that in Cool City apps. So, watch that, and um, you'll find out how to get it in case you don't have it. So You can just X out of that or minimize it and open up your iPod. Now go into Winterboard and since you put it in themes, the Winterboard has all your themes in there. You can just select these. So sliders 2.0 and you can see that right here too. So now you're gonna respring. Now I'm not doing anything to my iPod, I set it aside and so yeah. It's respringing right now, so I can't do anything to it anyway. So, so um, another thing, uh, uh, just, yeah. So, another thing about the symbols thing is if you have a picture for your desktop and it's too small or too big, you can um, make it bigger, like I did. So, yeah, that's like the same thing, like I did. You just go into paint and then you make it bigger or smaller depending on if it's bigger or smaller, so, you can see here, here's the picture, and then I edit it to make it the size of my desktop, so I'm going to X out of that, since my iPod has loaded, I'm going to turn on the screen splitter, so I can connect to it, and look, here's my iPod, I didn't do anything to it, I didn't change anything, so I close it, and I just simply press the button, I lock it, and then there's my slider that I made, the smiley face symbol. Then here is the other symbol. So, yeah, um, thanks for watching. Um, remember what I said earlier, that if I get to 110 views on how to record your computer screen with sound, that I'm going to make a how to jailbreak your iPod video. So, um, just keep that in mind and keep watching my videos. Um, you can, uh, comment, rate, and subscribe. Um, subscribe above here, so, uh, and also, um, uh, like me on Facebook, and, um, yeah, that's about it, um, thank, um, thanks for watching, um, I'll see you guys later.